Well, this morning, early voting starts in Connecticut for the first time, and there are a few things that you need to know before you head to your polling place. Yeah, Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Schuler is live at the Capitol Building in Hartford with those details. Good morning, Olivia. Tracy and Caitlin, good morning. Well, starting at 10 o'clock this morning, that's when you can vote for early voting at select locations. And this is somewhat of a new offering this year. And that is in regards to hopefully bringing out more voters. So helping with that voter turnout. Now, early voting was passed into law last year. Our team spoke to Gregory Pickett. He volunteers at local polling sites in Rocky Hill every presidential election. Now, election day can be crowded and busy so that he hopes early voting makes voting much easier for people. In fact, turnout was projected to be better with early voting. To prepare, the Registrars of Voters Association of Connecticut is increasing staffing levels at polling sites. This also makes that on election day, you can expect slightly smaller crowds. I am expecting, you know, at least a, a 70 to 80 percent turnout. The smaller the line, the better in my mind. Starting today, you can vote early at 10 o'clock this morning until 6 o'clock at night. And then on October 29th, that all goes a little bit earlier and a little bit later. So you can vote as early as 8 o'clock in the morning and vote up until 8 o'clock at night. Now, just a heads up for anyone that's going out to participate in early voting, just be mindful that your early voting location may be different than where you would vote on Election Day. We're live this morning in Hartford, Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.